So in the last video, well, maybe it was earlier. Anyway, I, I'm filming these today, but you won't see them till tomorrow. So I got all of the new Halloween stuff here in Adopt Me, but I only bought the stuff that's for the house. I didn't buy all the items that are for sale in the shop. However, I did buy the candy cannon. So what I'm about to do now is this. I am going to use the cannon to collect as much candy as I can to try to get every single item inside of the Halloween shop that is inside of the middle of the neighborhood so let me show you where it is if you're a lost and you don't know where to find it click this and it's going to show you how to get to the prizes my name is potato so maybe it's like i don't know the outfit or something okay guys let me show you where the store is it's all the way over here if you didn't see my other video and they have all these items, right? They have the stroller. They have this thing called the ghost vehicle. They have the, the tombstone ghostify. They have the flying broomstick, which I already got. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry. Wait, did I accidentally steal her stroller? Here, 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 I'm here. Sorry, I didn't mean to, how did I, t oh my goodness, wait. <gasps> Did she mean to give that to me? Oh my goodness. She literally just gave me the stroller that I was about to... Remember, I'm trying to like get all the items. Thank you so much. Oh Thank you. Thank you so much, Montserrat Max. Thank you, Montserrat Max. Where did my candy cannon go? Did I lose it? That's so crazy. Okay, it's all the way up here. I kind of lost track of what I was saying because, hold on, I'm gonna check track afterwards. I lost track of what I was saying because I can't believe she gave that to me. Like, thank you so much. When you're seeing this girl, swoop, swoop, let me throw some candy. Oh wait, really, it's, it's going all the way back there. You can either buy candy for the items or you can collect candy. But earlier, I bought this candy cannon right here and it shoots out unlimited candy. So I'm going to go into a small room in my house, in my smaller house, and I'm gonna just, pop the candy off until I have enough to buy every single item here so yeah that's what we're gonna do and let's see can I grab one of these here I don't think so yeah let me talk to the, the hellas horseman too oh fancy seeing you here I have several wonderful items in my shop some may make you faster some make you invisible some that make you fly, but some might make you die. That's if you don't read the safety label. What are they talking about? Am I real? Yes. Not they. What I mean is him. What does he mean something can make you die here? Tombstone Ghostify. Is there like some kind of candy that I'm not seeing? I can't take? I don't know, guys. But let's add up the amount of candy that we're going to have to save to get all these items. I mean, 10,650, I think. I probably messed it up at this point. 2,000, yeah, so let's just say we need 12,000 just to be on the safe side because I'm kind of losing track of the count. Okay, so we're going to stand in this room and we're going to throw candy at myself until I get to, let's just say 11,000 actually. Okay, we're going to load the smaller house. This is the smaller house, guys. Let's go inside. All right, so this thing has to reload every single 20 pieces of candy that you throw out, so Look, I'm gonna try to throw it at myself. And each candy is worth about five. So it has to reload every 100 candies. See, look, I'm throwing it and it's hitting the wall and it's going back to myself. See, you see how I do that? I figured this out earlier because I was giving away lots of candy. And when I brought everyone in the house and was like 
throwing the candy into that room, some of it bounced off the wall and went right back to me. So I realized, oh, that's a way that I can get candy for myself really quickly to get all the items. I wish I'd had I wish I had known that earlier because I didn't know that when I bought the broom. The broom is twenty thousand pieces of candy and I ended up spending a lot of Robux to get it. And had I known that I could collect my own candy and that it would be that easy, I would have just not bought the broom with the Robux. I would have just stood here for like thirty minutes and just thrown candy at the wall and back to myself. So now I'm gonna stop talking guys and I'm probably gonna like speed this up really quickly so it's gonna look like I'm moving super fast. So I just figured out a really easy way to do this. I thought the way that I was doing it before was easy, but sometimes when I kind of moved to the side, it would throw the candy all over the house and like it would miss me. So what you can do is you can literally just walk up to the wall. Not not the window, but an actual wall like like this. Get really close and like just click it. See, the candy doesn't even have anywhere to go, so it just bounces right back at you immediately. Look at the numbers down there, they're increasing, so yes, even though you can't see the candy, it's still going into my candy bag, so yeah, don't do what I was doing earlier, that was kind of kind of crazy, it works sometimes, it, other times it doesn't work, but this way, it works every single time. So I'm pretty sure I almost have enough. I want to get a little extra just to make sure because I don't want to go all the way there and have to walk all the way back here. So, all right, let's go up to like, let's try to get to 10,700 because I really don't remember the number that I said earlier. I was kind of distracted with trying to read the chat messages and stuff. So yeah, alrighty, that should be enough. Let's exit out of here and let's get on out there and let's get the stuff. Oh, someone said pretzel, can you adopt me? Hey guys! Okay, where am I even running to? Alright, so I'm just letting people know that chatted me, asked me to adopt them. I'm sorry guys, I'm not role playing right now. So I can't really adopt anyone. And where is the place? Okay, fine, I got lost. Let me go to. Now, okay, there we go. So yeah, if you get lost, click the pumpkin, click navigate to press. The one that I'm most excited about is the ghost vehicle. But first, let's start the small stuff. Zombie buffalo plushie. There we go, let's see what that's like. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Hi, Ella, let me give this to Ella. Or Rainflower, there you go, girl. Okay, so I already have the broom. If you didn't see my video earlier, let me show you really quickly what the broom is like. So yeah, you just 
click it like this and I'm sorry I'm not RP okay so you just click it like that way I'm oh <gasps> you have got to be kidding me look it says the flying broomstick magic only works at night I totally did not know that so that's why you would probably want to get both of these so this one says that it's a ghost vehicle right and I'm like why would I get a ghost vehicle if I already have thank you if I already have the broom maybe one works in the night and one works in the day wait what did, I think she just gave me that oh wow thank you so much okay guys so yeah we can't use the broomstick right now let's get the tombstone for 2500 candy yep all that candy that we just farmed now let's see what does it do <gasps> it makes us invisible it makes us invisible kind of let's see what happens when you put it up okay yeah so we're kind of invisible i'm pretty sure people can still see us though okay okay ella says she's gonna tell her friends <laughs> thank you ella okay the next one is the ghost vehicle for eight thousand let us get it okay your purchase was successful it's not in your inventory so let's see what the ghost vehicle does it's over here it's right next to the um the legendary cloud so does it fly wait where did it go okay it, okay here it is can anyone ride the ghost vehicle with you you know it's not really like it's not it, i don't think i can fly it like really high let me try again yeah so it kind of reminds me of the rainbow cloud okay guys so i got all the items and i'm going to get out of here so i'll see you guys next time and if you want to try to get the items from adopt me just i suggest you just you go to all the different houses and start saving up the candy and then you'll be able to get one of them and i suggest you go to a lot of different servers too because once you get candy from someone's house one time you can't get it again so go to every house leave the game go to a different server go to every house leave the game go to a different server but yeah i was just able to like blast the candy at myself but there's another way to do it so yeah i'll see you guys next time and let me load up the other house because i have a role play to finish bye guys thank you for watching my channel pretzel at so pretzel at so so at so pretzel at so